Hi everyone, Liz here, thanks for stopping by. So I've got just a little parcel to show you today, uh, just a very quick video because hubby's feeling a bit under the weather and um, we're having a few issues at the moment shall we say. So yeah, I've just nipped up to do a quick video because I don't want to leave it too many days without uh, saying hello. <laughs> Okay, um, this uh, is a little bit out of season as it were um, and it's from Amazon. Uh, yeah, you know when you talk about things on Amazon, in front of your Alexa and things, it's definitely listening because all of a sudden it sent me this special offer um, and said, would you like this? And I'm like, well, yes, of course. It should have been $9.99 and they said, you can get it today for $3.99. And obviously, uh, free postage, I'm an Amazon Prime member, so well, I mean, it's rude not to. And it is a six-piece Halloween DIY diamond painting sun catcher set. Uh, so, yeah, too late for this Halloween, but definitely great for next Halloween. And, uh, yeah, for £6.99, uh, for £3.99, I thought, well, why not? It was rude not to. So it winged its way to me, literally. <laughs> so, I've not opened it in the packet that it came in because I did get other things as well. So I wonder if they're counting six pieces then as... Because you've got... Oh, I don't know now. Okay. Oh, no, hang on. One, two, three, four, five, six. So is the six here then? Let me have a look. So they're very large. When I mean, you say they're, so, they're sun catchers, so they're not sort of key ring size, unless you want a really big statement piece. And then you could use it uh, as a, a key ring, I suppose. Uh, we've got your wickedy looking pumpkin, okay. Double sided as well. Uh, we've got, oh, your bat. I mean, literally, if you've got a boy that's into Batman, I suppose you could use that any time of year. So, yeah, okay. <laughs> look at that <laughs> so yeah that's a ghost with a big smile on its face uh, what did I see on Facebook the other day somebody put a meme out and it's um, there's no such thing as ghosts it's just people still trying to put the uh, king size duvet cover back on the quilt <laughs> and I thought yeah I can definitely relate to that one <laughs> And then, oh, we've got, oh, that's a bit of a, a scaredy looking cat. Look at all its hair stood on end. Yeah, it's probably yeah, one of Millie's friends. You know, she's jumped around and gone boo at it. And it's gone, woo. Yeah, I think it's really funny when cats all fuff up. <laughs> got green eyes. Ooh. So, yeah, you can always um, just alter out the mouth or the nose or whatever in different gems just to make it look um, a little bit less sort of cross and evilly looking. But, yeah, that's really good. OK, again, big sizes. Oh, yeah, there is six. So then we've got a spider in a spider's web. That's different. That's nice. Again, double sided. And, ooh, an eyeball. Ooh, look at that one. A bloodshot eyeball. Goodness me. That one's been to the Halloween party, hasn't it? <laughs> Would it be that way around? Yeah, it must be that way around because the teardrop's going to drop out that way, isn't it? I would have thought the teardrop would have been the other way up, though. Hmm. Oh, well. Oh, no, it goes that way. That's the little hole at the top and the little hole at the bottom. So the little teardrop or whatever's at the side. Oh, strange. Okay. Ooh, that one's a little bit odd. Right, let me get my tape measure. Quick measure. So, ooh, just over four inches. And then from the tail. So, so yeah, they're all about four inches-ish, between three and a half, four inches. So, yeah, a really good size. Bigger than your standard key ring. Well, that one's five inches, but obviously that's wider with the um, wings. That one's three and a half inches. So, yeah, nice size. Then let me grab a tray. So it looks like, I don't know why I was thinking, oh, I must start reading instructions. I was thinking there was only going to be three. So for three ninety nine, we've got six. So what does that make them? Uh, uh, just over 60, 65 pence each. Wow, and the double-sided. So, yeah, I'm glad I got them because 
I'll get these in for next year. As I say, um, when I actually looked at uh, my Halloween stuff, I thought I had a lot more than I did. Um, I did find another packet of key rings that I'd not done. I knew I had another packet, but I couldn't remember what they were. Um, I found those when I was tidying up. So, um, yes, yeah, so you've got your big um, crystals to go at the bottom. That's if you want to make them into this. Oh, these have got like little stars with a star on so they're a little bit different. So these are all different gems. We've got different colours in jump rings and chains and things for hanging. Um, and then you've got to make up your own little bead hanger yourself. Um, you, these used to all come already made up, but for whatever reason now, um, the last couple of times I've had any of these like sun catchers as they call them, these hanging things. Um, yeah, they've all come singly, so you've got to make them all up yourself. With the little teeny tiny jump rings there. Um, these jump rings aren't open either. So, or are they? Oh no, they are. Tell a lie, sorry. Take that back. Blah, 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 blah. Yep, the, these little tiny tiny jump rings, oh, you can't quite see, are actually already opened. So all you need to do is just close them together. Um, so yeah, this one's got the stars on. I mean, it's up to you how many or whatever you want to use on them. You've got your little close clasps there as well. Okay, so right. Looks like they're all the same. They've all got the little stars. Let me get these back in this bag. I don't want to lose any. She says, throwing them all over the desk. Yes. Oh dear. Yeah, as if it wasn't a big enough opening. Mind you, it wasn't the best way to put them all back in, I suppose. Not left anymore, have I? No, probably come across one later on. <laughs> so, yeah, they've all got the same little star in, so it doesn't matter which ones you use. They're all going to be the same, and you can either choose gold or silver. Um, I suppose you'd put the ghost with the silver, maybe, maybe the cat with the gold. You'd just see what drills you've got on them and see you don't even have to use those if you don't want to. And then they've all got a little hole at top and bottom. So you've got one for hanging it up and one for putting your dangly bit on the end. <laughs> I love that though. That definitely looks like somebody stuck in a duvet cover. <laughs> This is one that um, I did last year that I've already done um, and it's just some little gonks there. You get your little chain to put at the top with your jump ring and then this one, as I say, the uh, little like, the little uh, dangly chain, the little decoration there all came already done and all I had to do was put the uh, little, well, the big diamond on the end and then join the chain to the bottom of there and put the little hanger through there. But now they're more of a DIY project. So, yeah. But I think there's like 65 pence each or whatever. These are a brilliant value. Wow. I think you'd be lucky to actually go in anywhere and buy these for 65 pence, to be fair. You know, once they're completed. And, you know, put them away for next year. It's not a problem. You could even do them now if you wanted. Um, my Halloween decorations are going to stay up until bonfire night because we celebrate November the 5th here in the UK um, and have bonfires. That's if the weather's going to be nice enough to have a bonfire or anything. Uh, and that's when they let all the fireworks and everything off as well. So one of the stores, actually one of the supermarkets, um, it's called Asda here. It's part of the Walmart group. Uh, they're actually selling silent fireworks, which is a really, really good move. We've never had a problem with Millie with fireworks, but uh, I know last year we were looking after my friend's little dog Lottie and uh, she was not happy with fireworks at all. So uh, myself and Millie and Lottie all ended up on our bed and had the television on quite loud. And uh, yeah, we were just playing on the bed, you know, throwing balls and things for them just to keep them entertained a bit. So yeah, we got through it, but Lottie gets very, very upset um with fireworks and things so as i say we've been very lucky with millie and um, she's not upset by them somebody gave me a tip a long time ago um which was if like a loud bang or something goes off just yawn at your dog 
and then the dog thinks oh well you're not bothered it's nothing to worry about and we did that with our last Scotty um, Maisie and then we've done that with Millie and it seems to have worked obviously I can't guarantee it works maybe it's just Scotty dogs I don't know but uh, yeah it's worked and um, our previous <laughs> Our previous poor little uh, West Island White Terrier Westie that we had, he went um, deaf and pretty blind as well as he got older. And uh, yeah, he just insisted on going out for a walk on bonfire night. So we are the only people out walking a dog on bonfire night. And you could see people looking, thinking, what a stupid thing to do, be walking a dog on bonfire night. And I'm like, yeah, but he can't see it and he can't hear it. So he's not bothered. He just wants to go for his nighttime walk. <laughs> Obviously, you can't say that to everybody you meet. <laughs> we got a lot of funny looks. Okay, wow, there is a lot of colours in this. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 different. Oh, maybe not. 17, those two are the same. So, 16, 15. So, 15 different colours. Wow, okay. And they're all crystals. Yay! Oh, look at these. So we've got a red orange and a bright orange. And that's a very, very dark blue. And a little bit of black there. Purple, like a grapey colour. Bronzy colour. Oh, a very, very deep red. And a lemony colour. And a nice bright green. Cherry red. Whoops. And then a grey colour. And a greeny colour and a slightly lighter greeny colour and then two bags of your 310 black and two bags of some very sparkly crystals Ooh, look at those excellent like those so yeah this was one of my bag and buys and it actually wasn't using a vipon coupon it was amazon and um, actually saying to me we have a special offer for you would you like one and I said, oh, uh, yes. What did it say? Um, no, it's the Alexa machine, isn't it? And it'll say, we have some notifications for you. There are special offers on them. And uh, it read out the special offer and it says, would you like this? And it just read out what it was. And obviously, I've not even listened to it, let alone, because I, said, I thought it was only three pieces. Um, I thought, you know, when you saw the six, that it was like you'd get either the set of that one or the set of that one, not all of them together. And uh, yeah, so I just said, oh, yes, please. And uh, so I ordered and it came the next day. So, so sadly, too late for this year, really, uh, but definitely great for next year. So, yeah, I've got uh, six more Halloween decorations to put up next year. <laughs> For the princely sum of three pounds and ninety nine pence, right, I'm going to put those in this there as well. So keep those all together. It was just a standard toolkit pen, but and wax. And yeah, so, well, I hope you've enjoyed looking at these with me. As I say, just a quick video today, hopefully back to normal tomorrow. Um, I've got quite a few unboxings and things to show you as well. Some really exciting, great stuff. So anyway, if you've enjoyed looking at these with me, then as always, a thumbs up is very much appreciated. Any comments or questions in the comments down below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. And if you want to come back and see those unboxings and see what we get up to next and also join our little family, you can do all that by pressing that subscribe button down here. And then an all notifications bell pops up. And if you click on that, it'll let you know, oh, Liz has put up a new video. Do you want to go and watch it? Hopefully you'll say yes and you're not going to miss anything. Yay. OK, thanks ever so much for stopping by. And I do hope to see you all again soon. Bye for now.